Well, gave me the tour of the arena. What do you think? Well, while I've been out on business, been keeping up with everything. Been seeing it, hearing about it. It's just, where'd you get the, the funds for all this? Let's say I have jobs upon side jobs upon side jobs upon no side jobs, and each of them pay very, very highly. Yeah. I'm a man for hire. People don't realize that. I've been hearing so much ruckus. It's going to be a lot more. Yeah. Ah! Hello! Finally! Let's see. It's real nice on me, don't it? Yeah. Feel better. Yeah? Yeah, I appreciate that. I say everyone needs a chance. Sometimes people need to speak up. You know, I throw the chance at you. To explain the last time with that little King of Extreme belt or whatever, however happens between them two is great. And the reason I did it is because I want Fred Yehi to take notice. While he's sitting on his ass and running around the state of Georgia, Alabama, Tennessee, North Carolina, South Carolina, East fucking coast, all the way up to New York City, get a rope. Name the reference. Anyway, point being is, I'm gonna make Skrilla take his place, at least with the hearts of his true fans, the backyard fans. Now the sellout fans that go to the you know indies and they follow them all on the way up to the sellouts and the WWEs and the bullshit and the crap that you read about every goddamn day on the internet, page after page after page after page. Yeah, there's not anything like that here. And yet people are blind to see it. So I did it that way. And it passes it about. Gets it flowing. Gets their notice. And don't think for one moment I'm not going to have one of those types of matches at BACW. I will use my influence every chance I get. If that means I do it by the flood of GWC belts, like their promotional title, or if I just put that one on the line at a BACW event. Whichever. Do you see a BACW official stop me? Fight me? Nope. It's hard. You have their columnists Ooh. write the hurtful words. I have plans for that little piece of shit. And they're violent. They're very, very violent. Now, you both went home. You both saw my offer on the table. Don't worry about how it got there. Just know Santa Claus exists. And you're looking right at him. Mm. Uh, you know, join one. Stabbed in the back. Poster boy, whatever he is. You know. Supposed to ride till the wheels fall off. How I know you ain't gonna turn your back on me. Being real. Once you sign the contract, there's nothing that's hidden from you. You'll always know what I'm thinking, what I'm planning, and what I'm going to be doing. Granted, do you really use your souls? At all. I mean, what good have you really done with them? All I've seen is pain, misery, blood, stitches, glass, wood, barbed wire, lawn mowers, stereos, to toasters, planks. Fuck, name it. You've used it. 
but you sure as hell haven't donated anything, have you? Charity just isn't in your name. And I can smell it. I go to the ones that I know can spread the chaos I want spread to gain and benefit from what I give because I'm a giver. All this hype about worth it. I hear my brother hollering, it's worth it. It's worth it. Worth it. See, I can just say in that I hear his voice. Yeah, it's it's echoing in it's, the walls. It's worth it. That's <coughs> part. Do you think it's worth it, do you? Worth it. <sighs> Possible. Now, granted, for you, it's a brand new offer. For you, it's an upgrade. Worth it. Yeah. I was stable before stable was, I mean, being stable was cool. Of course. So is he real? I am where I am for a reason. I don't have to quote the Joker. You know where I got these scars. Mm-hmm. I know. It just takes you to sign the paperwork. Therefore, you upped it. Go anywhere you want. Well, uh... Other guys got a little incentive, so maybe you can uh, update my gold. Ah, <laughs> I'm going everywhere through. Doesn't matter. Um, that uh, yes, I've already. Whether you or zero or one, it really wouldn't matter. It was gonna happen today. But yeah, I I do have a replacement. I mean, you saw the offer on your table. Do you really think after a while I'm going to let you have tiny little things? Nope. That's not me. I go big or go home. So, I bring to you the new one. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Okay. This piece. Soldiers, I'll tell you uh, what. Hey, I'm stable. <laughs> I'm still stable. But checkmate, come on, do I look that smart? You ain't got a Chinese checkers mate I can join? <laughs> That's funny how you mentioned because I tried to get Fury, but he just never answered my phone calls. And I would say yes, but... If you don't wish to be participate in the operation against BACW and any other federation within the GWC, that is fine. You can go on your own solo career. You still have the stable's help. Checkmate will be busy doing what Checkmate does, but a member will always be there, no matter where you're at. So if you need help, they're there. If you don't, they're there. Uh, tell you what. I'm going to stable. Okay. But it's time for the Fright Brothers to shine. Uh, I'm glad you mentioned that. Being tag team right. champions and all. I'm twisting some things. Yeah? Because I said I want the chaos to rain and I want it to trek through like a motherfucking freight train. Well. And this is how it's going to happen. Your belts have now been renamed. Your belts are now the GWC Tag Team titles. And to be perfectly fucking honest, you better make them pretty. Better up them. Because what? that allows everyone, even DPW fuckers, to go for them. BACW people to go for them. You're the wrecking ball. Let's see how long you can keep them. This is more than MGBYW now. <coughs> oh, yes. You're the champion of MGBYW. There's not two belts. It's one belt. But by God. You wreck it all and be my wrecking crew. Tell you what, like I said, I'm unstable. But it's time for GWC's real tag team champions to shine. I'll stable with D Stoke. Default stable 24. Gotcha. Welcome to the So easy. Now it's just you. A yes is all it needs. Free will. It's a bitch, but I have to wait for your decision. Oh, well, like I said, I'm stable all the way. Been there and done it. Why change a good thing? Welcome aboard and now you're a champion. 
just like Asiago, just like almost everybody else is. Now it's starting to wrap up. Now people to see my importance. And maybe BACW is watching. And maybe they see my importance too. Because I'm going to start taking their belt. Oh, wait. I did. And they had the MCWA belt. Because we worked at the fact that they both look alike. Switch Rooney. And now Fred is being corrupted by my belt. While well, we have. His belt had to take his name off of it. It made me want to vomit. You don't want to see me vomit. It's like black. Is it blacker than Fred? Well, I don't think anything's blacker than Fred. I mean, you, I, you can't even see the guy. We <laughs> Can't even see the guy in the dark unless he smiles. True, or <laughs> or you catch him by surprise. He's wide-eyed. <laughs> Gotta hate that motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, I'm passing the hate around and people are starting to see exactly what he's all about. Everything we're all about, he's no longer about. People say, I'm wrong. I'm about to show the world how right I am. One friend of his at a time. But you can go if you want to. You'll hear me. You'll know you're next. Until then, plan, scheme. I'll know it too. Maybe then, we just might have a Freight Brother Championship match in the new arena at some point. Championship match. King of Extreme making an entire event of nothing but championship matches. Put everyone in the stable who has a belt to see can you keep it. So I'm all about challenges. I'll score by points. Who knows who wins? Might get an extra favor from me. Whatever it is. Well, GWC, you have it. It's Freight Brothers time, baby. And uh, speaking of the new arena, I haven't got to see it. Can you? Uh, yeah. Can you hook me up. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll send you there. Don't worry about it. Wow. The fuck did he go? Ah! Oh. Oh. oh, fucking thanks, hardcore. Okay, okay. MGBYWC is great. Let's get it.